Hello, I'm Seeks97. Today I'm going to be showing you how to set up the Geotech EXL5 multi format headset with a PC or laptop running Windows. So let's get started. So, the requirements for this are firstly a laptop and PC, obviously. So, this has to run Windows. As for Mac, it, there's different steps that you need that, and I don't have a Mac, so I can't really show you. And the second thing you need is obviously the headset with the connector, the headset connector, and then the third thing you need is obviously the the controller that makes everything in like the headset work. Now on the or on the other end of this controller, there's a USB and then there's a RCA connector, the red and white. We don't need these but because they're already connected so you can't really detach them, you just like leave them to the side but they're not needed. All you need is the USB, the controller, the headset and a laptop or PC running Windows. First step is to turn on your laptop or PC. Now while we're doing this, so we don't have to worry about turning it on later on in this tutorial, but now we've got our laptop or PC running Windows on. So the second step is to connect the headset connector into the inline controller. So now we need to match up the long side and the short side with the big side, the big hole and this little hole. So the long side being the big hole and then the small side being the small hole. So we connect those up. And there might be like a little gap there, but that should be alright as long as you push it as much as you can, then that's connected. Uh, now the third step is to set the Geotech inline controller to the right settings. So on this side where we have like two microphones and it says Xbox and PS3 PS3 slash PC, first with the microphones you want to change it to the one where there's no line going through it which means it's not the microphone is not muted so you can talk through it and then the second one which says xbox and ps3 slash pc you need to put that to pc because when you put it to the ps3 setting it also cancels the pc setting which is why it works with ps3 and pc but if you put the xbox setting it will not work and then these two things over here will come to later on in the tutorial the next step is to connect the USB cable of the headset into your PC. So, provided we have the headset connected to the controller, then we can get onto this step. So, get the USB, find an available port, and put it in. And that's your headset connected to your PC. Now, when we connect it to the computer or laptop, you should see three devices being installed USB composite device, USB input device and Geotech EXL5 headset driver. Now you might only have this Geotech EXL5 headset driver, that should be alright but for my case I had two other drives installed for some reason and they may be important or not so I won't touch them. But yeah, if you see ready to use and all of the drivers being installed then you know that your Geotech is completely set up with your computer or laptop. Now the thing with the volume is this, well basically you know that there's a voice and a game volume, so the game volume being the actual game and the voice volume being like you talking to someone, so maybe if it's Call of Duty and Playstation that will control like the shooting and the grenades and then that will control the people, the squeakers basically on the like private lobbies and stuff, but with a, when you connect to the PC, this game thing, the game volume does absolutely nothing, so if you put that up or put that down, it does absolutely nothing. Because all the audio coming through your earphones, your headphones, are all controlled by the voice. So this acts as like a master volume, so like a volume key on your laptop or PC. So if you want the audio in your if headphones to be higher, you just put that up. If you want it to be less, you put it down until you get to a point where it's all the way down and that's completely muted the headphones. But you can also control the volume from this, and you can also control it from your laptop or PC's normal volume buttons. So that's the thing with the volume with the Geotech headset on PC or laptop. Here's a diagram of the whole setup of connecting your Geotech EXL5 to your PC or laptop. This was entirely created by me from scratch and if you want to have it as like a download then there will be a link in the description below. Thanks for watching this tutorial by me and if you want to um, watch the tutorial on how to set this up with a PlayStation 3 and an audio test of this um, headset on the PC then click the links on the screen right now or in the description below if you're watching on a mobile device and please like this video if you liked it uh, please subscribe to my channel for more videos like it and my
um, for more videos of Minecraft Complete Modding Guide and Dream Weaver website building, which will come along quite nicely. And please follow me on Twitter and like me on Facebook because I'm trying to be a bit more social media like. And yeah, thanks for watching.